Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Looking at uh, bunker play today, uh, wanting to be able to spin it a little bit more. Super fun to hit that shot that sort of one hop and stops up by the pin. So I got about a 25 yard bunker shot here. Um, things that are important and when we're looking at how much we spin it, right? So as I'm coming in, I want to pick up the right amount of sand. So if I, if I take this ball here and I sort of go like, if I hit, say a little bit too far behind it and I end up getting a lot of sand on the face, it's hard to get a lot of friction if that's the case. So again, if it's a ton of sand, that's definitely not gonna have any friction. I'm trying to get the right amount of sand, so like a thin layer of sand that makes that um, sandpaper noise when I have the right amount of sand on the face, that's gonna allow me to spin it a little bit. Um, speed of swing is a factor, right? So I got grip on the face, getting a good amount of speed, so this is a little longer shot. Even though I'm downwind, I should still be able to spin it. Face is gonna be open, so my favorite is I draw this little line behind the ball, almost for this shot, if I'm really trying to spin it, how close to that line can I be so I get that right amount of sand. And then when I'm releasing it, keeping that loft on the club, so letting the club come snapping through. Uh, so I'll get my stance open here, face open, trying to hit right by this line to get some spin on this ball. So that one hit soft. I'll see if I can fly it a little further and actually get it to back up on this shot. So got my line here, face open. That one hit nice and soft again. Do a couple more. So great bunker shots, just not quite getting the contact that I want. There's the spinner. So that one, I brought it a little bit more from this spot for me. It felt like it was coming a bit more from the inside. There's one that's got some bite. So with that one, I'm just bringing, feeling like the club's coming just a little more from the end and really snapping from there through to get the club accelerating. Oh yeah, that's the one I wanted. So making sure the club's in a position where you can throw the loft on the back of the ball is really important. On my first couple, I was getting a little bit, probably slightly out and then having to hold it just a touch. They still worked out fine, but if, for me, I got the face open, club's a bit behind, and then from there I can really snap that release. Um, I'm keeping my pressure on my lead side in the, in the backswing as I do it, and then I get here, and then I, I can let my leg stand up a little bit as I let that club snap through. So getting that nice acceleration with the open face is key for that uh, spinning bunker shot. Give that a try, make sure there's no one behind the pin when you're hit, working on that one. Uh, draw the line in the sand, give yourself some feedback, uh, but that's always a fun one to hit if it hits up on the hill and sort of spins back towards the pin.